Hey everyone, and welcome back to Elon Musk land. Not just in the US, but also across the globe, General Motors is one of the oldest and most successful automakers. The firm has continued to develop and invent new technologies that have changed and will continue to transform the automotive industry's future. GM is a multinational corporation that creates and produces car components, distributes automobiles, and offers financial services. This business has a lengthy and fascinating history that dates all the way back to 1908 and continues to this day. Today, more than any other era in human history, there's an urgent need for improved energy sources that will help save the environment. The auto industry has been long recognized to harm the environment, both during the manufacturing process and when automobiles hit the road as a result of air pollution. General Motors, on the other hand, is an ecologically conscientious firm that has taken stops to lessen the environmental effect of its automobiles. This has been accomplished via the use and implementation of environmentally friendly programs. They spent years studying and developing alternative technologies that are going to enable them to create electric automobiles with lower environmental effects. So what are they planning? We're going to find out in today's video. But before we start, if you like this type of content, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you're aware of all the trending news around you. They released their first full-sized electric hybrid pickup in 2004. During the 90s, the firm started exploring all electric vehicles, with the Chevrolet Volt making its premiere in 2010. GM also makes battery packs for electric vehicles and has developed hydrogen fuel cell automobiles as well as flexible fuel vehicles. They've just announced the release of new technology that might usher in a new era for the electric vehicle industry, permanently transforming it for the better. In today's video, we're going to learn all there is to know about GM's latest innovation. Don't move a muscle as we answer any questions that you might have about this breakthrough technology that's set to transform the electric car industry forever and for the better. Let's take a closer look at how GM may have taken a step towards protecting the globe from global warming caused by air pollution. GM's got a lot of plans for additional electric vehicle models in the future. When I say this, I'm referring to the addition of 30 additional electric car models by 2025. Heavy duty trucks being the business's sole ICE vehicles by 2035, according to the corporation. The new Ultium battery system, which we're going to discuss in detail, is at the center of GM's electrification plan. And believe me when I say that this new piece of technology has a slew of incredible features. The new battery packs have a fresh design that will result in increased energy efficiency and performance. Like standard cylindrical battery cells, the new Ultium system will use a pouch cell system with a modular architecture. Ultium's long pouch cells waste less space and can stack on top of each other like pancakes or vertically like slices of toast. This is why the new design is preferable. Engineers can easily optimize energy density and vehicle architecture using this simple modular design, resulting in more miles per charge for less money. According to GM, one of the Ultium large format 100 amp hour cells would need 20 tiny cylindrical can cells, those used in standard battery packs, which would then deliver the same amount of power as one of the large format Ultium 100 amp hour batteries. GM continues claiming that their new battery technology is capable of powering electric vehicles of any form or size, even military tanks perhaps. GM being a well established car maker, has won the hearts of many thanks to its popular vehicle's excellent performance. And this has once again given rise to new engineering. GM's Ultium new battery packs feature a new and exciting piece of engineering. GM has successfully become one of the first automakers that's been able to stack long pouch cells vertically or horizontally into modules. It is new engineering and very unique to the industry. The electrical components of the battery will be incorporated into the modules to save even more space, reducing 80% of the battery pack wire compared to today's batteries. They lowered the height of the battery module behind the second row, which not only makes the ride more pleasant for the second row passengers, but also includes 22 kilowatt hours of energy storage to the area. Ultium cells can be deployed in a variety of positions, flat or upright, offering engineers more choice when building battery packs to match a vehicle's available space. The cells are assembled by GM into modules of 24 cells apiece. 12 modules are linked in series to create one 400 volt, 100 kilowatt hour layer in the future GMC Hummer EV. A pack with a total useful capacity of 200 kilowatt hours is formed by connecting two layers in parallel, enough to power any car. The pack on the Hummer, for instance, 
will enable top and bottom layers to be temporarily swapped from parallel to series, tripling the voltage to 800 volts and enabling the vehicle to charge at 350 kilowatt hours via Electrify America's new 800 volt charging stations. The flexibility to transition between 400 and 800 volt operation, according to GM, is a more cost effective option than using a specialized 800 volt system like the Porsche Taycans. According to Tim Gru, GM's global electrification and battery systems director, the Ulti Impact does not lose capacity due to excessive DC rapid charging. Hence, GM will not urge consumers to charge the battery pack below 100%. He also claims that the Ultium pack will last longer than the ones used in the Bolt EV, with real-world mileage ranging between 150,000 and 250,000 miles. Wireless cell monitoring is another feature of Ultium batteries. Each pair of two or three parallel connected cells transmits important data like temperature and voltage multiple times per second. When compared to the Bolt pack, this allows for an 80% reduction in the quantity of wiring. When new technology is introduced in the market, it sometimes gets connected with exorbitant pricing, but this will not be the case with this new battery, as we previously mentioned. GM is dedicated to investing in this innovative technology cost effectively and ethically, which will be utilized to power electric cars that you will undoubtedly love driving. Ultium batteries are going to use a cutting edge nickel cobalt magnesium aluminium, NCMA chemistry, which was developed to lower cobalt content by more than 70% in these batteries. GM said that the high quality raw materials will be used to achieve the highest performance while keeping the cost as low as feasibly possible for affordability. GM's collaborating with LG Energy Solution to produce Ultium power cells at a new factory in Ohio called Ultium Cells LLC, integrating manufacturing and electrochemical capabilities. The ground was broken in May 2020, steel construction started, and site preparation is on schedule to make a GM plant. GM will have a 30 gigawatt hours of capacity at the plant, and will be able to manufacture batteries in-house, which will be essential in making electric vehicles more accessible to all drivers. GM has gone on to provide further details about the next generation battery, which is expected to revolutionize the electric vehicle market. The car maker has agreed to collaborate with Solid Energy Systems (SES), an MIT offshoot creating prototype lithium metal batteries with roughly double the capacity of existing lithium ion cells. Lithium metal batteries, as a reminder, use lithium metal instead of carbon anodes, resulting in lighter, more powerful cells. Although increased resistance and dendrite filaments that tend to develop on the anodes cause batteries to short circuit and heat up. However, Solid Energy created an electrolyte coating for lithium metal foil that operates at ambient temperature, while previous lithium metal batteries needed to be heated up to 175 degrees F to function. The business has developed a non-flammable, low-resistance liquid electrolyte that won't form dendrites when in touch with lithium metal. It created prototype batteries with the same metal storage capabilities as lithium-ion cells in half the size, thanks to those breakthroughs. AI-powered battery management software has also been created by the business to improve EV performance and safety. SES was acquired by GM in 2015, and the two companies managed to make a tight working partnership since then. The car maker owns 49 lithium metal-related patents, with 45 still pending, and demonstrated its lithium metal battery cells last year. GM and SES plan to build a prototype line for a high-capacity pre-production battery in Woburn, Massachusetts by 2023 according to the new development agreement. According to the company, the increased energy density might result in a longer range or equivalent range of a smaller pack than conventional batteries of the same size. This might help it cut vehicle weight and size, while allowing room for more electronics. With this next generation Ultium chemistry, GM believes are on the cusp of a new, once in a generation improvement in energy density and cost. There's even more room to improve in both categories and they intend to innovate faster than any other company in this space. Later this year, the GM aims to unveil its first Ultium-based EVs, beginning with the Cruise Origin Shuttle and then moving on to the Cadillac, Hummer and other brands. The next generation Ultium battery technology is still a few years off, but like with any other battery technology, there's still a lot that can go wrong along the road. You will soon be able to drive your ideal electric vehicle model that is specifically fitted to your requirements, thanks to this revolutionary invention. But what accounts for this? 
Simply said, Ultium packs are versatile enough to incorporate numerous combinations of modules to custom tailor energy and range needs, enabling us to supply electric vehicles for Buick, Cadillac, Chevrolet and GMC vehicles. This revolutionary battery pack simplifies vehicle design, allowing for better aerodynamics, aesthetics, comfort, driving feel and storage while maintaining vehicle height and length. Thanks to GM, the electric vehicle sector is seeing a new dawn. That's it for today guys, thank you for watching this video and while you're still here, go ahead and click on one of these two videos on your screen. See you there!